Hello everyone, welcome back to a Petty Bore rating video where I'm going to be rating all the products that I got in this month's Petty Bore box for April. If you're new here, my name is Laura and I post about skincare, lifestyle, wellness. Consider subscribing if you'd like to keep updated on why I post. So I've been doing Petty Bore unboxing videos and also Detox Box and uh, one other uh, Detox, well, one other beauty box, what was it called? It was the Nourish Beauty Box. I've done quite a lot of those unboxing videos and I've decided to go with Petty Bore because that's the most affordable and they have a lot of different samples with uh, ethical cosmetics, skincare, hair care, and I seem to find something new in all their beauty box. Well, you rarely get any of the same products in their beauty boxes and you're able to have a profile where you could customize all of your preferences for the beauty boxes and get, um, you know, just products that are in your shade and kind of uh, so personalized to you as well. I'm actually going to be rating all of these products for each of the four products that I get in the beauty boxes every month. I'm going to be rating them in categories and I'm going to be um, just sharing with you my honest thoughts on them and opinions as I use the products. Uh, I've already used all these products that came in this month's beauty box. Okay, so as you can see, I have uh, the categories here that say favorite, always stocked, recommended, worth the use. Uh, essential, impressed, I would repurchase, use and recycle or donate, lip gloss, and it says an essential go-to gloss that complements your natural lip color and completes your effortless everyday makeup look. This gloss is buttery smooth, never sticky, and feels weightless on your lips. Minori, I don't really care about this product in particular. Uh, the shade is, I got in the shade Blossom. So the category that I would probably put this uh, Minori lip gloss in would be Donate. I Like I said, I mean, I'm not really looking to stock up or use any new lip glosses. I already have lip products that I use and that I find have a more, uh, like, the scent of it I'm going to like a lot better than this one. And it's just, it has basically a fruity scent and I'm, I'm not really a fan of those type of scents, so that's why... I'm not really going to be using it at all. Ada Lip Beauty Lip Rally. Refresh and rejuvenate your pout with this exfoliating, nourishing lip scrub made from natural sugar beets, cocoa seed butter, shea oil, and jojoba oil. So when I use this Ada Lip Beauty, I noticed that it just does a surface type of exfoliation. It's not really like a deep exfoliation. And the beads really... Uh, dissolve really quickly like within a few seconds after you apply it and then you start to massage it on your lips um, I would say like 30 to 60 seconds the beads disappear uh, but I did notice that the hydration is um, long lasting so it is going to stay there longer than the beads that exfoliate your lips because those dissolve really quickly so you'll probably get hydrating after you apply this and if you don't wipe it off with you know a towelette or Anything like that, you'll probably get hydration for at least an hour with this. Categorize this lip rally um, and use and recycle. I'll probably use it uh, a few more times when my lips uh, feel like they need exfoliation. I really wasn't that impressed with the uh, amount of exfoliation that I got. It's just a subtle exfoliation, a surface level. It really wasn't deep exfoliation. Um, you'll definitely get softer lips for sure, but you're not going to get like a lot of like deep exfoliation, a lot of exfoliation from this product. It definitely wasn't the amount of exfoliation that I wanted from a product for my lips because um, I did, uh, you know, just exfoliate a few of uh, the skin that needed to be exfoliated, but I still saw like patches of dry skin on my lips um, or dry flakes on my lips and those stayed there. The sugar scrubs dissolved way too quickly. So if I were to rate this product, I would definitely give it a 2.5 out of 5. I mean, it it definitely leave my lips subtly more soft and the hydration I could definitely say that the hydration is really long lasting for this product. Kalos, the triple threat detox mask, an at home facial in just 20 minutes. This mask gives skin a serious boost with the rejuvenating benefits of glycolic acid, hyaluronic acid, and coenzyme Q10. Plus, it's packed with antioxidants and free radical fighters. The triple threat detox mask was my favorite in this beauty box, so I would probably rate it in. Um, recommend worth the use. Um, 
I just really liked how it, uh, when I applied it, I got mild, well there were kind of moderate tingling sensations and you could really feel that it really did uh, go deep within your skin just to get it like exfoliated and it's not only surface, you know, it doesn't only like detoxify and exfoliate uh, the surface of your skin, it does go deep within your skin. So for the first 10 minutes of using this product, I definitely got uh, moderate tingling sensations and then after that, uh, they weren't really there anymore, the product did dry on my skin and my skin felt really tight, like it was tightening and it also has little beads in it to help exfoliate your skin as well so when I washed this detox mask off, it did leave my skin with a silky soft finish so I think this that was like my most favorite part about this uh, detox mask is like the finish is like really silky soft I just really liked the uh, softness that it left my skin with uh, softer than usual, you're really gonna get um, notice. You're really gonna get a lot of softening from this detox mask, and yeah, and like I said, it's like silky soft. It's not just like um, yeah, it's ultra soft. It's not just soft. You're really gonna get that softness. This product did say that it brightens and provides you with uh, you know volumizes your skin. I didn't really notice any brightening after I washed it off, but I did notice just like subtle, barely noticeable uh, volumizing on my uh, like it looked a little bit more plump um, my my face and all that. But you know it's, it wasn't really that noticeable. Uh, yeah, but yeah, I, I really just was impressed with the uh, the uh, detoxification and you know the way that it performed on my skin. The consistency is a thick and creamy uh, and then when you apply it, it goes on like paste on your skin as well and you just uh, yeah and the scent is like a citrus with floral undertones and I really liked it and I would probably rate this product a 4 out of 5 because I really liked the way it performed on my skin like I said and it just gives you um, a like great purification and detoxification as well. A detox hydrating gel from Golden Fade and MD, an oil-free skin balancing moisturizer created with beta hydroxy acid to detox congested skin to leave you with a vibrant youthful complexion. So for this um, moisturizer, it's not a moist not like any other moisturizer that I've used before because it has like a gel texture. And it felt like if I was wearing a facial cleanser when I was applying it. And it does stay on your skin for a few minutes after you apply it. So it's not quick absorbing at all. So it's just going to leave your skin moist and um, just for a few minutes. And then it slowly soaks in your skin after you apply it as well. So the finish to this, uh, I would say it left you with a natural glow. Uh, but once it soaked in your skin, uh, for me, it wasn't enough hydration. It felt like my skin needed another layer of hydration. So I went in with another moisturizer. Uh, it really wasn't hydrating. It did leave my skin with a natural glow. It's unscented and if I were to rate it, I would probably give it a 3 out of 5. Um, it does, like I said, it does uh, leave your skin looking vibrant, which is what it promises, uh, but it wasn't enough hydration for me. Use and recycle because I'm going to finish using it just like as uh, after I cleanse my skin, I can wear it just to give my skin a natural glow and then wear an actual moisturizer um, after I wear this just to give my skin more hydration. So those were all of the products that I got in this month's Pettivore box and my rating for all of them. Uh, I really hope that you enjoyed watching this video and my favorite of course being the detox mask from Kalos and I'm going to be linking all these products in the description if you'd like to learn more about them. Uh, so yeah, remember to like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching.